Real quickly, this is my South Bend Heavy 10 uh, frequency drive driven lathe. Um, I have the original drum switch running in forward and reverse. Um, it also has an emergency stop, which you can push in. You know, to use the override manual stop you can use as well. It's got a jog feature, which if I push this one and this one will make it go in reverse and jog speed. And then this one and this one, so this is the jog button, and this is the direction, will go forward. Um, as well, these are the speed controls when running. So if I engage it into forward and push the red button, I would slow it down some. It's nearly, nearly stopped, so it might stop there. Okay, and now it's going to speed up when I push the green button. So now pushing the green button in will increase the speed. And then red button again, slow. So one other feature I have in this is that when I go from forward to reverse quickly, it faults. It will not actually go into reverse. Um, and then in which case I would need to hit the reset button here because the drive is an error. When I hit the reset button with it and off, It'll reset it, and now I'll take off into the reverse. It will reverse, but you can't do it too quickly. That's just a safety feature I built in so I don't do anything stupid, which I'm good at. So, there it is. Um, I actually have the drive mounted under the back side of the cabinet, um, which is really inaccessible on this machine. It uh, It's not a very big drive, and it's actually a drive I had, so I made this one work. This is one way to adapt a drive to a, um, a lathe.